what's up everybody it's your girl shantae back with another episode of chatting with shantae how in the world are y'all doing me i am doing fabulous so as y'all can see from the title i am here to kind of give y'all an update from the last time y'all seen me talk about the sweet potato pie collection by donna's recipe since that video i have done my wash day routine it is posted and i will link it below if you haven't seen it now it is a fairly quick video just because i was doing it for other platforms so i didn't want them to be too i didn't want it to be too too long so that's the purpose of this video to kind of go through my thoughts and opinions on each product and show you clips from my wash day routine so that way you'll see what i'm talking about and yeah this is like my overall review thoughts and opinions about the collection and all that good stuff and more specifically someone who has type 4b 4c low porosity hair so if you are in that boat with me then listen up because i'm gonna keep it real i'm gonna keep it honest all right so without further ado make sure you like comment subscribe hit the bell so you're notified when i drop a video grab your snacks grab your drinks prop your feet up and let's get it let's go so i'm just gonna start off with the accessory real quick just because it is still part of the collection mm -hmm. so the fine mist spray bottle super sleek super cute came in it couldn't have come at a better time because i've been wanting one of these forever okay the one that i was rocking with it wasn't a fine mist it was a regular like tch, tch, tch. that thing was giving me the blues the blues the purples the blacks and the browns all the colors okay it was giving me the straight up blues and this came in so much handy during my wash day after my wash day when i you know done quick little styles refreshing my styles and things like that absolutely love it um if you are natural and listen like i've said in my other videos you do not have to be natural to use these products but you know what i mean um but if you are natural getting you one of these types of spray bottles is super essential because we don't need our hair to be super soaking wet but you know just a little bit just to coat the strands and things like that to do what we have to do so this came in perfect handy so love that <clears throat> So let's get into this shampoo, this extra creamy moisturizing shampoo. So here's what it looks like. And I'll probably have a video showing you like a different, uh, like a better, but here's what it looks like. Oh, don't do it, girl. Don't do it. <clears throat> we don't waste product, y'all. We don't waste product. <clears throat> so I'll probably show you a different video, but you see it's very creamy love it and a little bit goes a long way i will say that a little bit goes a long way it lathered beautifully i had my hair sectioned off you know in four little cake pops as i call them and i was just working through each section i it didn't feel like i had to use a whole bunch to you know get the job done for it to lather a little bit went a long way and my hair and my scalp felt really really well cleansed and I absolutely loved it. The amount of slip that my hair was provided with after using the shampoo, absolutely love it. Smelled amazing. And I, making sure it's not leaking, sorry. I love the fact that it is a moisturizing shampoo just because when you have that type four low porosity hair, our biggest thing is moisture. Locking in the moisture, retaining the moisture, getting the moisture, making sure that the moisture we already have isn't taken away too, too much, but we still want to make sure our scalp and hair is well cleansed. So I love the fact that even though it cleansed my hair uh, and scalp very well, my hair and scalp wasn't feeling brittle and dehydrated and dry and stripped. Absolutely love that because it's kind of you know, with clarifying shampoos and other shampoos, it can be a little bit too abrasive. Like, yeah, you want to make sure that all the product buildup and everything is gone, but those natural oils, those essential oils that our hair and scalp kind of need so that, they, so that they won't be too, too dry and brittle, yeah, they kind of get carried away and washed down the drain. But with this, hair felt really, really good. Scalp felt really, really good and cleansed from all the product buildup that I had. And it wasn't like, oh my goodness, my hair feels like straw felt really creamy, felt really moisturized. Absolutely love it. I'm here for it. And the fact that a little bit went a long way, I'm not mad at it. So the shampoo gets an A from me. An A plus, if you will. All right. So, uh-oh, my table. I have a marble uh, centerpiece uh, built into my table, so it spins. <laughs> so I have to be very careful. So if I moved, I'm so sorry. So now we're going to get into the extra creamy moisturizing conditioner. And so this is when I was doing my detangling, of course. Um, I don't know if y'all can see. There we go. 
So again, very rich, very creamy. Again, you know how you would think of a sweet potato pie. Sweet potato pies are very rich and creamy and things like that. So that's the consistency of these products. It feels really, really good. So I went into each section with the conditioner to do my detangling and everything like that. Detangling, I did some, uh, I did finger detangling. A breeze, a literal breeze a literal breeze when it came to detangling and conditioning my hair so after i detangled and everything like that i twisted my uh, each section and just let the conditioner sit for a while and let it do its thing once i rinsed it out it was so soft it was like the conditioner just melted on my strands it did what it had to do and it just melted and it rinsed right off and my hair felt so so it felt like i went to the salon now baby i haven't stepped foot in a salon since i've been natural Okay, I've been doing everything myself, all right? And it felt like this was professionally done. Like, I, I'm not even kidding. And we're only on the second step, and I'm already saying this. And so the moisturizing conditioner, absolutely love it. And again, a little bit went a long way. I found with these products, you don't have to keep going in and, you know, going in too much and dipping in the products just to get, you know, some payoff. A little bit went a long way, which means you're getting your money's worth because, these products are going to last you a while you're going to get multiple uses out of each of them so <clears throat> excuse me so the moisturizing conditioner she did that detangling was a breeze washing everything curls was already starting to pop curls was already starting to pop and we haven't even done the lco method yet that should tell you something so the conditioner and listen y'all know as naturals we love a good conditioner we love a good conditioner and the consistency, not too thick to where you, it feels like you're just slabbing a bunch of product on your hair and it's weighing your hair down. Um, so these products are really good for people who have like a finer head of hair, who are afraid of products weighing their hair down. Mm -mm. And because you don't have to use too much product, it works out beautifully. And even though I do have thick hair, so I'm not really afraid of products weighing my hair down. You know, I know there's such a thing as putting too much product on your hair but because of the my grade of hair I'm not afraid of going in with product because usually I have to but because I didn't have to go in as heavy as I usually do and I still got even better results <laughs> baby I was in the shower like and listen I that's when I started to realize that's why they be in them commercials just smiling and the sun be shining because they wash day is a breeze Baby, I ain't never been smiling during no wash day. It's been like, oh, Lord, I'm, you know, and you using this much of the product just for one section. Baby, uh-uh, not with these. Donna's recipe said, look, look, you're getting your money's worth, baby. You are getting your money's worth. And we're going to make sure you get a whole bunch of payoff with not little effort, but you ain't got to use as much product, you know, to get the results. So now we're out the shower. Everything's all good. And then I went in with the LCO method. Um, I prefer to do the LCO method just because I do have low porosity hair. It just works better for me. Um, some people do the L LLC method. Neither is right or wrong. Neither is better or worse. It's just all depending on your hair type and what works best for your hair. So I would say if you're not really sure which method would work best for you, because I've done the LLC method and then I, you know, uh, compared. So I would say if you want to try, um, well, first do a porosity test just to see where your hair, you know, is. But if you still want to see which one will work better for you, I would say do one section with the LCO method and then the uh, other section with the LOC method and see, you know, compare them. If your hair feels better over here, or over here, if your hair looks better over here, you know which one you prefer and then you'll know which order you want to do them. But again, neither is right or wrong. It's just all a preference. But again, I went in with the LCO method. So of course I went in with the leave-in conditioner. Baby, me and this leave-in conditioner have gotten well acquainted these past some odd days, okay? Because <laughs> after I took my twist out and even when I was refreshing my twist and stuff like that, I still went in with a little bit of product just because I like to do that. And it was amazing, okay? So even when I did this style today, it's really basic. Just got my hair pulled back and, you know, a little flat twist roll type of a situation. Um, I'm still trying to perfect my flat twist. So from a distance, it looks like I did it. But if you get up close, it's like, ooh, girl. But all I did was go in with a little bit of water and a little bit of leave-in conditioner just to, you know, do what I gotta do. And that's all I did. And as you can see, you know, it has like a nice little healthy shine and all that good stuff. So hair is cleansed, hair feels super duper soft and there's no product residue or anything like that. It doesn't feel greasy or oily. 
love it but it doesn't feel dry either so yeah but went in with the extra creamy leave-in conditioner to prep for styling so i put my hair back in those four sections and i went in with a little bit of water because by this time i was doing some other stuff and my hair needed just a little bit of water i didn't need to drench it because it was still damp but again because of my hair's porosity and texture and stuff like that i just had to go in with a little teensy weensy bit of water on each section just to wake it back up and went in with the product so the extra creamy leave-in conditioner love Love it so much you can see it there a little bit and again these products are not too thick and they're not too thin that's what I love and this is when I went in with some detangling some more uh, I went in with my detangling brush just beautiful glided everything worked the product in and it was great so and these products smell so good and that's another thing because I know uh, I am someone who is very sensitive to scents and fragrances, especially when it comes to like shampoos and conditioners, you know, all the uh, styling products. I prefer to use products that don't have too much of a fragrance just because I will get a headache easily. With these, yeah, you smell the sweet potato, you smell the scent, but it's not overbearing. It's not like, oh my goodness, when is this going to wear off? I'm, I'm sick of it. It smells so good. You're going to be getting a whole bunch of compliments, child. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> Girl, use this collection, baby. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> but no, you are going to get some compliments because you're going to turn some heads, all right? So be prepared. Listen, be prepared. You're going to be walking around like a whole dessert just saying so yes uh went in with the leave-in everything was great next i went in with the extra creamy hair cream so this was um you know like the hair butter and things like that so this consistency is a little bit thicker but again not to the point where it just feels like you have a whole bunch of products slabbed down slabbed down on your hair and things like that but because it is the styler and things like that um looks like this so a little bit thicker, but still has like that whipped consistency, which I love. My hair absolutely loved. Actually, I'm just talking about these two together. These two products right here, the entire collection, if you couldn't tell, I absolutely love every single thing from the water bottle to the styling products. Everything gets a 10 out of 10 for me. Spoiler alert. <laughs> okay. But these two products right here, the final two products, it didn't make no sense. It really didn't make no sense how well-defined my curls have begun to get, have begun to get, have, have, what? Anyway, that's how good they were. Anyway, but even in the shower, my curls were formed really nicely and stuff like that. But with these two products, like these are, I would say deemed as like the curl enhancing, you know? So if you are someone who likes to just do like a regular wash and go, you know, no twisting and nothing like that, baby, these products are gonna have you right these products are going to have you right okay and even when i was going in twisting my hair i had to stop and show y'all and y'all will see uh somewhere on the screen how well defined my curls were and a little bit of product like none of these products i had to be heavy-handed with none of these products i had to be heavy-handed with thick hair 4b 4c hair low porosity hair meaning i need moisture any chance like anywhere i can get moisture i'm gonna get it because i need it and the fact that I was, I didn't have to be heavy handed at all, at all. And I would say before I finish off with these two products, I, cause I'm just used to being heavy handed in the shower and using these products. So I could have even slack, not slack out, but use a teensy weensy bit less than what I did in the shower with the shampoo and the conditioner. I still didn't use a lot because I was very still surprised at how much I still had left in here because I didn't have to use a lot. But I could have probably gone a little bit less as well and still gotten great results, still gotten well cleansed, well moisturized and things like that. So that's why I am very impressed with this, with this product line. Like, yeah, I know I'm affiliated with the brand and stuff like that, but I went into it not being biased. Of course, I was very excited to use the products because, you know, it's like a long time coming. But if I didn't like it or if it didn't work for my hair, if I had product residue, like if it, if it was flaky and dry, if I had complications, I promise you, I would be on here telling y'all the, the truth. Right hand to God, the truth. These products really, like they shocked me. And I don't want to say... I'm surprised at how well they worked because I, you know, 
like you can tell if a product's going to be good or you have high hopes for it but when it actually exceeds your expectations it's like oh okay this is y'all did not come to play they said this was over a year in the making and you can tell this isn't something that they just whipped up really quickly like it's not even from the very beginning with just the two products the biotin uh gummies and the strength hair oil those were already in uh in the works well before we even found out anything about donna's recipe like you can literally go back and look at videos of auntie tab talking about how she was developing something almost two years before we even found out about it you know what i'm saying so i love how much love and attention and time and effort went into these products and you can tell you can just tell you really can and i know i keep emphasizing type 4 hair and stuff like that but it's really important for me to be an example or representation and there are plenty of um donna's cousins my cousins you know who also have similar hair textures as me so you'll be seeing you know all of our um wash day routines and stuff like that so make sure you follow the donna's recipe instagram page to you know see everybody's different um reviews and wash day routines on different uh types of hair <clears throat> but when it comes to type 4 hair trust me it's like it's hard it's hard finding products that really cater to our hair and that give us that moisture and that you know that payoff that we need and a lot of times we have to go heavy handed with products to get a little bit of payoff so these products were thick enough to coat our hair strands well for me i'm speaking for myself but the products were thick enough to coat my hands my hair strands but not to the point where it was weighing my hair down no extra residue left on my hair hair very well cleansed without feeling stripped curls popping styling detangling easy hair smells great yeah y'all not seeing it like y'all not getting it okay so i would really highly advise y'all to check out this collection because this wasn't just something that they was like okay let's just put something together let's put our name on it and go no you can tell like a lot went into these products like a lot so i'm just very thoroughly impressed not shocked or surprised just because you know if you know auntie tab listen she gonna make sure it's right but it's still like wow and it's like for my hair type like what an entire collection from start to finish that works really well and the results are just bomb baby okay so let me get off the um soapbox of preaching that's all i gotta say um but where am i at okay yeah so the hair cream this is when i really realized how well my hair was responding to these products curls curls were popping okay and i was doing two strand twists but i was like oh oh baby okay so then to seal everything in i went in with the extra creamy hair and scalp oil so like i said in one of my videos um <clears throat> It may have been my unboxing video or it may have been the other video as well. Um, I was kind of taken aback at the texture of this oil just because I was thinking of an actual like oil consistency. And so this is kind of like reminiscent of like an old school kind of a hair grease type of situation. But it melts down like a literal butter. Like a like you know how you melt butter? That's how this product melted. Okay, it, I know it looks like I went in with these products. I know it does, but I it, I really didn't. <laughs> I really didn't. I know it looks like I dug into this product. I promise I did. <laughs> but yes, so oh my goodness. Ow, I keep hitting my elbow. <laughs> Please. Anyway, the thing I love so much about this product is all the other products, the uh, shampoo, the leave-in, the regular conditioner, and the hair cream, they all smell like the filling of the sweet potato pot, the actual sweet potato and stuff like that. This smells like the crust. It smells like a buttery, flaky, vanilla crust. Light and airy. It, it's like you want to eat it. You really are tempted to eat this. And so this just seals everything in, all right? And this is when I began doing my two-strand twist. And that's when I had to pause, like, oh. Because this also had my curls popping. Like, popping. And like I said, it does leave your hair with, like, a natural shine. Like, a healthy, you know, a little something-something. But not greasy, you know. Not like a whole bunch of grease still on your fingers or anything like that. It just coats everything well, seals everything together, locks all the moisture in. And, you know, your hair is good to go. Now, I will say, um, on 
well depending on when you're watching this today is december 8th and so uh not too long ago there was an instagram live with gina who is the co-founder of donna's recipe along with auntie tab hey gina she and terry k who is a you know motivational influencer on tiktok instagram absolutely love him they did an instagram live and uh another one i think this this is the second one actually and uh he has locks so he actually did a quick demonstration using the hair and scalp oil. You can watch the replay on Instagram. So go to the Don's Recipe page and check it out. So uh, there's a lot of people who ask, do these products work well for locks? They do. They do. Um, again, you don't have to be natural to use these products. It works for everybody, whether you have relaxed hair, natural hair, 4B, 3A, 2, 2, whatever you got. Um, it works for everybody. Um, there are a lot of people who ask about um, color treated hair. It works. You know, there are several women who are, you know, the silver sisters, okay, who have beautiful, beautiful heads of silver, gray hair. It works super well for them. Um, Cause with the sweet potato, it can be a little bit like, okay, is this gonna alter the uh, hair color or anything? It doesn't, it doesn't at all. Um, what else? Can children use these products? Yes. Um, men can use the products. Women, black, white, Hispanic, Asian. Everyone can use these products. It's literally for everyone. Um, I know you see a lot of us and we do our reviews on the products and stuff like that. We talk about them and a lot of us are natural, <laughs> but it does work for several people, several, like everyone can use these products. Okay. And if you're not sure if you're able to use them, just make sure you look at all the ingredients, make sure you talk to your doctors. Cause listen, <laughs> okay um but yes but this product right here oh this smells so good bro and it's just the way to have my hair looking like after styling and using these products somebody will probably think you got your hair professionally done i am not even just saying that to say that like i'm being so serious right now like the lusciousness the creaminess the way your hair looks and feels and smells okay and so i if you can't tell and I already gave y'all a spoiler alert. Everything gets a 10 out of 10 for me. Everything from the water bottle to the hair oil and everything in between gets a 10 out of 10. So I would highly, highly encourage you, especially if, you, if you've been looking to get on a healthier hair regimen, you've been in need of some new products. If you have, you know, similar hair type as me, and I'm not saying just because we have similar hair types and textures that it's automatically gonna work for you the way it did for me. Um, but I will say, give it a try, give it a try. These products, amazing. Again, if you're like me and you're sensitive to scents, I had no issues. Like it makes you want to keep using these products because of how well they smell. And the scent does wear off, of course. It's not gonna just be very potent, but you know, you're bound to turn heads. You know, you go to hug somebody or you lay next to somebody and they just, what you doing? Hey, hey, this is my hair, stop it. <laughs> yeah, that. Somebody gonna think you baking a little pop in here. No, I'm the dessert. <laughs> I'm the dessert. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> y'all know I cut up. Anyway, but no, seriously, these products are absolutely amazing. I'm so very proud. I'm so very impressed. I am excited to keep using these products and again i really hope you all as well so if you have been looking at these products you've been seeing everyone's reviews on them and everything that's been surrounding since the launch of these products i would say i do have a link for you all to click on in the bio of this video and you can go ahead and place your orders there and you can use my discount code shante c-h-a-n-t-e and you get an additional 10 percent off your order so That'll help you save a little bit more money. And the prices are really, really good, like very, very reasonable. So on top of that, you are getting an additional 10% off using my code. So that's a win, win, win. And yes, I hope you all enjoyed this video. And again, I really hope you all are, you know, um, able to get your hands on these products and try them out. Um, I know so many people have placed their orders. They're super excited and everyone's reviews on them, everyone who has them already everyone's hair is amazing and to see how well it works for every uh hair type hair texture you can't beat it so oh and one more thing shout out to everybody who showed me love uh yesterday or depending on when you're watching this on my hair commercial so i came up with a concept to you know promote the brand and promote the products and i did like a 
70s hair commercial inspired video auntie tab loved it everyone was showing me love so thank you so much for that listen i watched a whole bunch of hair commercials growing up i wanted to be in a hair commercial whether it was just for me dr miracle even though those were a little bit like huh okay but dr miracle afro sheen ultra sheen like i love those commercials i've always wanted to be a part of them god willing i will be one day but until then i hope you all enjoyed this review and i will catch y'all in the next episode i love y'all bye <laughs>